guys, how's it going? Onion Man here. And today I got an unboxing for you guys. I got a headset by a company called Fine Fine. I've done a mic for them before. If you guys want to check that video out, I'll put it up in the card and down in the description. Uh, this is the H6 wired headset. So yeah, let's check it out. So this headset is their H6 model. It has 7.1 virtual surround sound. Uh, supposedly it also has um, built-in controls into the cable, so that's kind of neat. Uh, according to the box here, it's a USB headset, it's a condenser microphone, which is also detachable. It is an omnidirectional mic, um, plug and play, it also has R RGB on the side if you guys can see on the side it's like a looping color so I, I don't think you can change it but it does like cycle through the colors and yeah that's basically it so let's get into the unboxing okay guys so let's get into the unboxing here um let's open it up here it's a very simple box it's not really much in here it looks like we got instruction manual which most of the time i don't read but yeah, it's very simple. H6 gaming headset. And then looks like we got just the headset itself. Let's open it up here. Cable's kind of in the middle here. It's a decently long cable too. It's also a it's also a braided cable, which is kind of nice. So let's get that box out of the way. Here is the headset. We got a nice kind of fake leather top, I think. It's got some okay padding. It's not the best I've felt, but it's, it's okay. Um, the rest of it look like to be plastic, except for these extenders here. These are actually metal. Yeah, that's plastic as well. We got our mic spot, which means the microphone is probably in the box still. Here's also our microphone. I do I do appreciate that it's detachable. That just slots right into there. It only goes one way because it has a certain fit to it. The arrow, there's a, there's a faint arrow on here, and an arrow on the side here as well. You just gotta match them up. And it does bend quite nicely. The plus and minus for your volume, there's 7.1 surround sound, virtual surround sound button here. And we got some kind of button on the side. There's also an EQ button on the side here. I do believe this thing has different preset EQs that you can go through. And this is, I don't know if this is a lock or maybe a mute button. Could be a mute button. Let's do a comfort test here quickly. See how that works. Okay, that is actually not, not too bad. I would have to say this is the best. This one's a lot more comfortable than that other uh, Gico G80 headset I did, that wireless one. This one seems to fit to my head a little better. That one had more of a, a solid plastic piece on top, so it kind of fanned out a little farther and it made it uncomfortable. It was usable, but it was just wasn't as good. This one has a little more flexibility. You can adjust it a little bit nicer. Overall, yeah, this is actually, I'd say probably a four out of five for sure. Ear cups are nice and nice and soft. And the headset overall is not too heavy, so it's not too bad. Yeah, I'll give it a four out of five for that. Microphone reaches nicely. Yeah, overall that's pretty good. I have the headset plugged in here, and as you can see, you can kind of see the RGB on the side, 
with the smiley face. I guess that's their logo for this headset. I don't know. Um, has a little, gotta be a little bit careful with these wires. They are braided, so that's good. But it extends out decently far. And because this part is metal, it's a little more durable. Other than that, there's no buttons on here because it is all in the cable. And I did look up this uh, button here on the side, the little slider. It is a mute button to turn the mic on and off. And then the EQ on the side, on the other side, those are three different EQ modes for music, game, and movie. 7.1, kind of like, it almost makes it a little bit louder. I don't know if it's actually a true 7.1. It is virtual 7.1, so it's not like your sound system 7.1 quality, but it does maybe do a little more immersive sound than just the standard, but it's, it's really hard to notice. Overall, the headset is very comfortable. Like I said, it is a lot more comfortable than that other one I did. Uh, I think the design is just better. It's just a little more flexible. But yeah, overall, this is a really awesome headset as far as design goes. Okay, guys, so this is the recording from the microphone here. Uh, testing one, two, three, four. Testing one, two, three, four. I'm not 100% sure how it sounds, but just, uh, I guess I'll find out once I edit this. But I'm sure it's decent. It seems like a... At least the build quality seems okay, so... Um, yeah, that's the microphone sound. I also forgot to mention, uh, as I'm testing this mic here, this headset also does work on PS5 as well as PC. Uh, it is USB, so... Um, yeah, it works for those two. I have not tested on Xbox. It says it doesn't, but... Um, so yeah, guys, that is my quick unboxing and impressions of the H6 wired headset from Fine Fine. Uh, I will put a link to this headset down in the description. Uh, thanks to Fine Fine for sending me this headset to check out. And as always guys, if you want to subscribe to the channel for more videos like this, then uh, that would be awesome. And as always guys, I will see you in the next video.